helicopter arrives at noon. So let's get our let's get our drink on. I know hand signs too. Hmm. You just hang tight, buddy. I bet this won't go bad at all. Gotten yourself infected somehow. Row, row. Right, my beautiful baby girl. What do I need? When does it start getting misogynistic? I feel like I'm riding that line, diminishing this fucking intelligent, strong character to my baby girl angel. <laughs> you fucking drones. I don't remember this. As long as I got the green light, that's fine. <laughs> it's about, are you gonna fucking ring me at some point today? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. It's been a long day, isn't it? What the fuck is this? How did they get the chopper down? How the fuck? How did zombies get the chopper down? The shoes were a nice touch. How did you just all get stuck in there? Without these zombies would just let us walk right through. Oh god, is that another fucking helicopter right here? Boom. No! There's an infinite supply of Apache helicopters. <laughs> Oh my god! I am the press. That's why they all want to kill me. That has actually just clicked now. I'm like, I'm just an innocent guy. I'm sitting here with a fucking camera and a big journalist hat with the press pass in the front. I won't tell nobody, I swears! <laughs> he has covered wars. It's like the one thing I have to remember about him. Apart from being like an absolute sex machine. Isabella, I saw a big hole. No, like in the park. No, like it was in a pillar. <laughs> oh, for real, what the fuck am I supposed to be doing? I wait to turn into his out, do you think? <laughs> Is Isabella supposed to tell me? Like, it just says get the items that she tells you, but she's not telling me fucking anything. Do I need to be here? No, because the, I, I feel like I remember there's an item in the food place. And I was in there and she didn't call. So maybe I just go to where it's like supposed to be. Maybe I can kickstart this. Oh! Okay. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I get it. Alright, now, now that I know where we're going. Maybe going through the park was a bad idea. I remember the last time when I played this. Sorry, the last time. The first time I played this. I missed out on getting the ending. I had all of the survivors saved. I saved everybody. No, not because I was good, because I saved scum the fuck out of it. I was just waiting in the waiting room, or the security room. And then, uh, Isabella called and wanted to talk to me, so I head down. But yeah, the helicopter shot the fuck out of me, and if you die before overtime mode via the special forces, you get kidnapped. So I wake up in the fucking helicopter handcuffed i don't know what's going on i'm like oh no <laughs> panicking and i try to escape and i get caught one of the fucking special forces guys sees me and butts me in the head with a gun i lose four hours and i miss the fucking helicopter all because i had to go and say hello to my baby girl angel 
If I'm not careful, I can die here. Coffee filters. I'm going to do this as fast as I can. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I am going to run fast. <laughs> no, you're not. No, you're not. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Whenever I say it's fine like that, what happens in my head is I hear from the last five years Jeremy Jordan's part. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. To resist temptation. Where is this fucking magnifying glass? Why is it making me run arse ways around? Where are we going? So the guide arrow doesn't know... Doesn't know about the shortcuts. Is that what it is? Because I was in Paradise Plaza and I could have come straight fucking here. Can I check? Is it on the map instead of just fucking... Ooh, I'm gonna be... Very upset. Why do they list them in that really awkward order? I can go straight to Paradise Plaza. Here's my big brain working right now. I can go straight to Paradise Plaza via the shortcuts. Then we get the developing solution there. Look at him. And now, last but not least. Alright, we got everything. Ouch. Do I risk? Maybe I do the shortcut to Wonderland. And then go out that way because I don't really want a chance getting bleeding hopped by that uh, helicopter. Isabella, I'm here. I have all of the stuff. Work your magic, babe. So, this drug that stops the parasite growth... Is it yummy? Have you ever made it before, or is it just a theory? When I was working in the medical lab, my brother asked me to research a method of suppressing the parasite. Of course, back then, we didn't extract the hormones directly. We synthesized them in the lab. Okay. So, he was looking to protect himself from his own terrorist scheme. He wanted a way out, is that it? I don't know. Okay. I know he didn't bring the drug with him here. Sorry, I know your brother is I like have no idea what he dead and all. I'm only asking. You think I'm just making excuses, but Carlito kept things from me. <laughs> even if this, uh, even if you do manage to make this drug. It won't completely cure me, will it? I'm afraid not. When the effect wears off, the parasite will develop as it normally would, continuing oh, wow. the zombification process. That lot of good that does me. I mean, thank you, babe. That's what I mean to say. This is all I need as far as supplies are concerned. Okay. Now all we need are some queens. Yeah. We got one right here. Hey, babe. Babe. Did you hear my joke, babe? Just how long do you suppose your drug will prevent me from turning into a walking corpse? No, oh, like six minutes. During my research, I was never able to conduct proper clinical studies. To a certain extent, the period of effectiveness depends on each patient's physiology. So because I'm a tank... Could be a year. <sighs> Maybe only a week. There's no way to tell for sure. It'll be like ten years because I'm a tank. Yeah. Fantastic. <sighs> so, I'll be a walking zombie time bomb. That's an album title. A time bomb? What? Did you just now remember? Once the drug's development was complete, Carlito poured his energy into starting an NPO dedicated to helping war orphans. 
We had 50 doses of the drug prepared. Not long after that, the NPO managed to find homes for a large group of children. Mm hmm. Want to guess just how many? Oh. Oh my God. Magnus Carlson is a zombie? You're saying he <laughs> infected these kids and then gave them your drug? That he made 50 little ticking time bombs? I don't know. I just don't know. It is possible, though. New York, D.C., L.A. These kids are spread all over the country. Uh-oh. If your theory is right, the entire country could be crawling with zombies by now. Boop. Shit, I don't know what's worse. That we don't know for sure, that we can't warn anyone about this. It's the same problem, Frank. <laughs> What we need to do right now is prepare the hormone and get you taken care of. I'll get you some hormones, babe. Don't worry about that. Right, so I need to go and get queens. I need to get ten queens? I don't have the inventory space for this shit. Who's doing disco fingers? There's one. A one. A two. Now, can I bring these back one at a time, I wonder? Or even perhaps two at a time. Bring me some adult queens and I can get started. Okay. Give. One's not enough. Yeah, I have another one in my hand. Will you stop talking to me? There you go. Yeah, I know it's not enough. You said ten. I understand that the number ten means ten. You don't have to tell me every time. Sorry, Frank. This still isn't enough. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you. You look like you're having a good time. Any ravers? Any ravers out here? Anybody raving? Babe, I got three more. And if you tell me every time I hand you one, it's still not enough, Frank. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Thank you. Women. <laughs> The benefit, again, I've said this a few times, of watching on YouTube is that you don't have to sit here and watch this with me because this will be cut. I'm sorry, Frank, it's still not enough. Okay, wait, it's changed. <laughs> right, so here's the plan. We go down to the food shop, we get fucked up on wine, and then on the way back we get two queens and we go to our queen. Isabella, and then we're we're easy peasy. We're fixed to this whole zombie nonsense. A few giggles, few goofs, few gaffs. Glug glug glug. Bit of wine. Right. We're looking for one last queen, and then and zombie bye bye time. Look at that quick scoping in Dead Rising. Exactly what I'm looking for. Having a good time at the rave, Mrs. One more ought to do it. Well, you're looking lucky. I have one in my pocket. Right here. Blue. Sorry, I don't inject that in blue. You're it's just a thing. Me with that, huh? No, Frank, I haven't the needle for the laugh. Okay, Doc. Let's get this over with. Ouchies! Ah, oh, I hate needles. Frank, you've had your balls bitten off by a zombie before. Just relax. His arm starts sizzling. I'm turning into one of them for a while. <clears throat> okay. Next on the agenda. Figure out a way to get the hell out of here. While yeah. I was isolating the hormone, I managed to identify a pheromone that suppresses the attack instinct in adult parasites. How did you do that with a laptop? 
and shit Remember, I found in a mall. The zombies don't like the way it smells. How do you know that? You give me a little more time. I should be able to produce some of this pheromone. They think it smells bad? You think we could use something like that to keep them away from us? Yeah, that's what she's talking about, Frank. Jesus Christ. We could just walk right past them and get out of here. In theory? Yeah, <laughs> that's what I said. <laughs> Either way, it's certainly better than nothing. There was a cave outside where the helicopter crashed. It was packed with zombies. I mean, shoulder to shoulder. But it may lead somewhere outside. If it works, your anti-zombie perfume could keep us safe in that cave. He's a very emotive speaker, isn't he? What do you say? You ready to get the hell out of here? <laughs> Let's get the frick out of Dodge, babe. They're Go get married in Zombie Vegas. On experiments. We'll only have enough to use it once. Okay, okay, okay. Whatever you say. I trust you with my life, babe. I don't know, but considering how many of them keep pouring out of here, it must be connected to something. Isabella, look. Any other way out of here is guarded by the military. If we're gonna get out of here and put a stop to Carlito's plan, we've got to go in there. Look, they're already parting for us. <laughs> it's not like we're unarmed. We got your smelly perfume, don't we? <sighs> Perfume. Frank. <laughs> I wouldn't be alive right now if your shot hadn't worked. The That's not true. Work too. I know it. Frank, you still have like 18 hours before you turn into a zombie, even with out the thing. <laughs> Alright. Let's go. Yeah. Into the depths, all the zombors.